Hi, Casper from Bose Wine on the 18th of February 2016. I'm tasting a wine I have a real soft spot for, I must say. This is a Premier Cru Saint Aubin. Uh, and the vineyard is called Monceau, or En Monceau, to give it its full title. And this is one of the many uh, Saint Aubin's uh, red and white from the portfolio of vineyards owned by the domain Marc Collin. And uh, I always, I'm always drawn to Monceau uh, of all the white Premier Cru Saint Aubin's. Um, to me, it just always seems to have a little more mineral sort of tension to it, um, an expression um, that appeals to me. Uh, anyway, here we go. Oh nine, so you know, right vintage. You'd expect this to be quite forward, but it's really pale. Beautiful, very slight lime tinge to its pale lemon colour, and uh, let's smell it. It's still oak in, in evidence here, a little bit of sort of toastiness, um, smoky, hot, hot buttered toast. It's a classic old smell of, of, of white burgundy, hot buttered toast. But there's a minerality here, sort of talcum and a bit of. Um, lemon and rusted apple fruit and a floral note, sort of dried white flowers, almost sort of chamomile I guess but this sort of crushed, crushed rock aroma mm. and you know as, as ever this has, this has that mineral tension to it, it's 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 young, the, the nutty wood back there on the palette. There's a um wonderfully dense wine, you know, but it's got right through it this fine sort of powdered minerality and lovely sort of lemony, almost lemon oil sort of um, freshness uh, all the way through. Nice long wine, busy wine, you know, there's nice energy in it despite the fact that it's an 09, you know, some of the 09s get quite, are quite heavy and perhaps lacking a bit of energy, but this certainly, and, and there now still the juiciness, my salivary glands are working hard to contain the effect of the acidity and um, it's just delicious, lovely, it's almost, you know, talking to Damien Collin, um, with whom I taste uh, every year when I go there, he um, said to me once, some years ago, you know, that we generally pick about a week before um, my father picked. And I, I, f I like that, you know, I, li I like this fact that we're getting away from the peachy white burgundies that emphasise this sort of ripe fruit more to the whip crack sort of more chiseled more focused bur uh, white burgundies that emphasize terroir and and uh, minerality and freshness and you know this is this is almost like a, a slightly mildly oak riesling sort of character very sort of clear cut or mm. i'm all for it i must say stunning wine stunning value um superb love it